my muscles. Um, we go to school just to learn eye muscles, how to measure them, how to treat double vision, how to treat people that have concussions and eyes are not fully aligned. We normally help uh, pediatric ophthalmologists mostly work with pediatric ophthalmologists. So once the child comes into the clinic, what we first do is I ask the parents the questions of what brought them in. After that, I try to calm the child down and try to do an eye exam first. That includes either letters or numbers. And after that, we try to look at their depth perception. We try to look at their eye alignment, make sure that the eyes are straight. So once I do the full eye exam, if the child is new to us in the clinic, we will, the likelihood of them getting drops is very high and if they are returning to us and they are up for their yearly exam, they will also be getting eye So kids need eye drops so that the doctor can see the back of the eye, make sure that the eyes are healthy, not only that, but also make sure that the child does not have a prescription either to see whether they are nearsighted, farsighted, or if they have any astigmatism. Um, once the pupils are dilated, the child can, if they are old enough to go to school, they can actually go to school. But if they go home, they can read, they can watch TV, they can play, nothing will happen to the eyes and their depth perception should be. Any child that is dilated or not dilated and who come back for a routine eye exam will actually get a toy at the front desk when they are leaving and sometimes once they get dilated I actually sneak in a toy for them. So they might be getting two.